Hey, what's going on everybody? In this episode, I'm gonna be teaching you how to create a Minecraft server for free, no cost. Now, it's gonna be slightly limited, so if you want to create a really well-established Minecraft server, you're probably going to want to look into paid hosting, but I'm gonna show you how you can get some free hosting for your friends or for some testing or whatever it might be. So go ahead and open a web browser and travel to this website here. I honestly, I don't know how to say this. Aternos, I don't know. But what we're gonna do is we're going to use this website and they offer free hosting. And as you can see, I have a server here and there are ads throughout here, which is how they support this website. So definitely an important piece to this. So yeah, it's a little obnoxious, but you know, they gotta do what they gotta do. So I already have a server here and I'll show you a little bit about how this works. So we can go into this server and you can see it's currently offline. And the way they have it set up is that as long as someone is connected to this server, that it'll stay online. But if it's empty for a period of time, it'll shut off for them to basically allow it to be free. They save costs. They're not just going to host top of the line servers for free forever. So that's one of the downsides, but it is a good way to get started. So let's go ahead and click start. And you can see it's starting up now. It'll have the commands that are running here. Okay, I think it's done go ahead and hit connect and this will give you the extra information now let's talk about how to join a server on minecraft which i'm assuming if you're watching this you've probably already done this unless you're just starting the series from the beginning so let's go ahead and open up minecraft now i'm going to launch this with forge but i'll show you if you run into any errors basically what you'll do is you'll just go and switch this over to the vanilla latest release if there's any conflicts between your mods and the servers, you might run into issues and we'll see if that happens. So from here, we will select multiplayer. We can click direct connection or add server if you want to add it to your list here. Let's just go with direct connection and here's where you put your server address. So let's grab that right here. Copy, paste, join server. I used uh, command V on Mac or control V to paste that there. All right, so this is the server, and how is this different than single player? Well, this is a shared server environment, so anybody else can join this world and play. So as long as you have this IP address, you can paste that in and join. However, keep in mind that with this free server, it's only running when you're playing. So if there's no one in the server, it's going to disconnect. You can see here, players one out of 20. If that goes down to zero, it's going to stop the server after a period of time. So let's go ahead and try that out. We're going to disconnect and we're actually just going to add this server to our list. So we'll just call this Aternos and paste in that server address, hit done. And now I can just click that whenever I want. And it'll show the connection here, the ping, 136 milliseconds. This is a hosting or here. This is a paid server. So for now, we're just going to stick with Adernos and maybe we'll check out hosting in the next episode. But since this is zero, we should expect to see a countdown timer on our server homepage. You can see that countdown timer right here in this corner. We have a minute and 12 seconds. This only shows up when no one's playing. So I guess maybe you could just leave someone logged in all the time. I uh, don't know. This is a great way if you just want to play with some friends or just test some stuff out because, in fact, this platform allows you to do some stuff with mods. So let's take a look at the steps required to get that mod installed for your server so everyone who joins will have that same experience. So when you look at your server page, you'll see down here in the software it says vanilla, which is just the default Minecraft. So what you can do is we can actually, you can explore in the software for different options for example we got forge and fabric here but there's also an option for mod packs which would be closer to what we were doing in the previous video curse forge so we can go into here and we'll just search better minecraft and we'll go with the the one without fabric in the square brackets so we'll go with this one here and reinstall take note this will replace any settings and your world will be deleted so yeah be careful you might want to create a backup but I have nothing important, so I'm just going to reinstall. And now taking a look back at our server page, you can see it says Curse Forge Better Minecraft. So let's go ahead, start this server up. Yes, I accept, and there we go. Finally, my golly, that took forever. All right, and then on Minecraft, we'll just join that server. Oh, you're kidding me. All right, I just got wrecked. 
So we're on 1.17, which I didn't realize what we were installing on the server was for 1.16. To fix this, inside of CurseForge, you can actually search for better Minecraft, and you can download the 1.16 version here, which I downloaded. So when I connect using this version, I can connect to the server just fine, or you could figure out how to update your server software. So now from our games, I have two versions here, Better Minecraft and Better Minecraft, which is pretty confusing, but I know that this is the 1.16 version and this is the 1.17 version. So here we are connected to the server. And this will include any extra options, including the mini-map and new structures, which you can go explore. If you were to join the server, I would be able to see you when we could play together. Taking a look back at adernos.org, you can see that the server is online and there is no countdown timer. So this will just keep running. We have one out of 20 players, which you can go over and see that in the player.